stop scrolling. Imagine a job where your boss says, build a bridge for water across miles of hills. Welcome to ancient Rome, where our Lego engineer's motto is, don't go with the flow, make the flow go. Scene one, our brick hero decked out in a toga and a hard hat because safety first, surveys the landscape, scratching his Lego chin as he wonders why all hills seem to be uphill. Scene two, He's stacking bricks with Roman precision, dodging a supervisor who keeps yelling, straighter, straighter, while trying not to trip over stray Lego soldiers. Scene three, the proud moment arrives as water finally gushes through the aqueduct, only to soak a nearby Roman senator's sandals. Oops, plumbing wasn't included in the job description. Here's a splashy fact. Roman aqueducts could carry water over 60 miles, powered only by gravity and endless slave labor. No pumps, just pure ancient engineering genius. Romans delivered over 200 million gallons of water daily to their cities, enough to fill a Lego-sized swimming pool every second. So next time you turn on a tap, thank a Roman and maybe a Lego engineer with soggy feet. Because in ancient Rome, the secret to civilization wasn't just roads or gladiators. It was water with style and a whole lot of bricks.